Bird flu isn't just bad news for poultry farmers. It also signals a dire season ahead for shooters. The winter outbreak of avian influenza in France is in the area where most of the UK's game birds breed. The game farms of the Vendée and Loire Antique regions export large numbers of eggs and chicks to the UK. Until July 2022, no eggs or chicks can leave these disease control zones without a licence. In 2019, the last normal year of sales pre-COVID, the UK imported about 20 million pheasants and up to 10 million partridges from France. The majority is eggs for hatching in the UK. We've had nothing or very little has come over for the last eight weeks or so since uh, end of February, beginning of March. We don't expect any noticeable change to that situation for the immediate future. There are possibilities that could give rise to imports resuming. We don't have specific idea of timelines, so it's almost impossible to really guess how much of the season can be salvaged. But we have already lost yeah. a good half of the season's imports. And it's affecting partridges disproportionately more than pheasants because we're more heavily, heavily reliant on French imports for rearing partridges than we are for pheasants. Paul Childerley runs game bird shoots in Bedfordshire. He says the shortage of birds is leading to a steep rise in prices. There's been massive uh, prices throughout the site industry anyway, with, with fuel and with feed prices going through the roof. Um, and this on top, uh, they've been banded about some prices for, for pulps, partridge pulps ready for, for release, 10 to 17 pounds, which is ludicrous because when you you're looking at it's like getting 40% back return on that. You know, you're going to have to put on sort of like a £10 bird, you have to put on £25 just to get somewhere in the right region of getting your money back or breaking even on it. So put that on top of the birds already, you know, you're looking at it's like a 70 to a £90 per bird. I just can't see it being feasible for a lot of people that actually enjoy their game shooting. Basque says bird flu in France is forcing some game farms to look at sourcing stock from elsewhere, such as Spain. Others in the UK have increased the capacity of their own laying stock. So I think a number of shoots um, have spoken to the game farmers. The game farmers have looked for alternative sources of eggs. So some have upped their capacity. Um, they may start their egg production slightly earlier. They may run it slightly later. Other people have gone to Portugal, places such as that. But unfortunately, if we don't get the level of eggs that we've had from France bought into the country, there will be significant sh shortages. Basque and the GFA aim to keep gamekeepers up to date with the developing situation. Yeah. Both groups advise anyone buying in game birds for rearing and releasing to plan ahead by holding early discussions with game farms and suppliers. After two years of Covid and now this on top, it, you know, it, there's a lot of shoots are struggling. I mean, a lot of... A lot of um, Shoots have just closed for the year and said that's it, I'm not doing it. Um, for me, well, I did a, I got onto it early this year with the, with the price increases of the fuel and, and the food um, and, and things in general. I, I, I did my pricing quite early, got structure in, got everything sorted, um, and then this hits. Um, bookings were amazing this year as well, or are amazing. If you are solely a rearer and a shoot, they've got some hard times, I think, personally, yeah. Serious. It may already be too late for some shoots, as the two largest game farms in France have both told their suppliers that nothing will reach the UK until July at the earliest.